We're so happy to have you here. I'm excited to be here. Please introduce yourself to everybody. I'm Annie Cruz. As if you needed an introduction. <laughs> <laughs> Why are you here today, Annie Cruz? Because I'm about to get gang banged. Yay! Get my hands full, get yep. airtight. tight. Yeah. All of the book. <laughs> Why on earth would you do something like that? Because I love it. Awesome. Yeah. Awesome. Tell us what you love about gang bangs. I just love having my hands full, literally. Like, um, <laughs> I'm one of those girls that, like, somehow manages in, like, outside of, like, outside of making movies and porn and stuff like that, I'm one of those girls that manages to somehow find herself in an impromptu gangbang. I don't know how. So there's just something about, like, all the bodies involved, the different sizes and, the you know, the smells, the feelings, just everything. There's just something about just being overpowered by... A lot of men. <laughs> and you know, it's so funny that you say the whole you find yourself in these situations where mm -hmm. you have these impromptu gangbangs because nobody ever says that when they go here. It's so true, and I have witness proof too. They're yeah. like, Jesus Christ, every time we hang out with crews, something <laughs> happens, and then they're like, that, Was that for a movie? No, 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 that just happened on a typical Saturday night. You know what I mean? Uh -huh. I don't know how, I don't even know how I managed to do that. It just, it's just like, you know, you meet a bunch of people, and then next thing I know, I'm like, okay, there's three dicks in front of me. What do I do with them? Oh, okay, let's just all have a good time. So, yeah, yeah. <laughs> most of the time, the ladies come here, like, I really want to do a gangbang. I'm really interested in this, but how do you like orchestrate that? I just don't know how to do it. Well, the last gangbang that I had that was impromptu, literally, it was me and I want to say five or six dudes. Mm -hmm. um, and it started, we went to a warehouse party mm -hmm. and um, I met this guy, I started flirting with him, you know, and we started making out, whatever. And then I was like, oh, there's gonna be an after party at my friend's. So long story short, he brings his friends with him. Uh -huh. He brings two guys. So there's, th actually it was three guys, so a total of four. And then the one guy started freaking out when he started seeing me kind of like, you know, kind of touching all the other guys. And then more people from the same party started showing up because it was my buddy's place and he um, had called everybody like, after party at my place or whatever. So more people started showing up and the next thing you know, there's more dudes coming into the room. And I have a really funny, interesting thing to say about this um, story because as we're having a good time, um, the one of, cause you know, it's not just men that came, obviously came to this house for the after party. Um, there was a girl that like peeked into the room and started freaking out and was like, what's going on in there? Is she okay? You know what I mean? And then my, my, my best friend whose house we were at, he had to reassure, oh, darling, darling, listen, listen. <laughs> it's, it's Annie Cruz. She, she does this. <laughs> That's awesome. Yeah. Well, sounds like. You're somebody we all want to know. Yeah, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> Any, let's talk about your do's and your don'ts for today. Could you please go over everything um, from your checklist, please? Uh, my checklist, um, do's, you can uh, fuck my mouth, fuck my pussy, fuck my ass, DP, um, face slapping, spitting, hair pulling, choking. Um, what do, I guess I should just say what I don't like. Yeah, that's probably easy. <laughs> you know what? Okay, what I don't like, um, so my nipples are super sensitive, uh, more specifically my left, because I had a nipple ring, like, completely ripped out. How bad? So whenever I, um, I was fucking this girl, <laughs> <laughs> she was eating my pussy, getting really rough with me, and it was already kind of, like, starting to tug a little bit. And she just got super rough with me, and I didn't initially notice oh, that it yeah. had ripped until I looked down. And when I looked down, it was like dang, it was a hoop dangling from like a very thin strip of my nipple. Ow. I actually have a scar from it, and um, and then there was blood, and I was like, now I can feel the pain. So wow, it's like super sensitive. So we stay that. away from your left. My nipple. left nipple, yeah. Okay. Everything else is fair game. I mm -hmm. like more um, like hitting on my mm -hmm. tits mm -hmm. as opposed to tweaking of the nipples, but mm -hmm. I can take it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> cool. Um, what you. There's something about fisting. We're not going to fist your... You know, I'm able to fist my ass. I've had guys fist my ass, but it's been so long. Yeah. I don't even know if I'll be able to do that. I'm, I'm, maybe I'm wrong. Yeah. And I could, but well, I could probably know, fist myself. Yeah. Um, I don't know. We can work up to it if you really want to try. It's, you know, I, I, whatever the energy brings. Yeah, exactly. I mean, like it's it's kind of like whatever happens, happens. Exactly. You know? <laughs> uh, but I like to know what is an ex absolute no so that I know that those yeah. things don't For happen. Me, I feel like because it's been a long time, it might not even be able to happen. Yeah. I mean, you know, I'm down to try because yeah. it's fun. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. But um, probably mo it probably won't happen because it's, it's my, but I might surprise myself. Sometimes I'm like, no, I can't do that. And then I take two dicks in my ass and I'm like, okay. So yeah. Totally. Oh, no double vag. Okay. No double anal. Mm -hmm. Just because it's been a while, like no I said. No problem. Um, I 
Only what about person. cum? Where do you where do you like to take their cum? Where do you feeling like you want their cum today? Do anywhere you, and everywhere. Anywhere and everywhere. Yeah, I mean, I like <laughs> I like getting cream pie. I like um, in my mouth. Uh, I think I like it more so in my mouth than on my face, but I'll take it on the face. Okay. I just don't like it in my eye, you know. Yeah. But yeah. I just I like cum in general, so it doesn't right. really matter where. Right. It's kind of like wherever the dick is. I'm like, just give it to me. <laughs> yeah, cool. Lovely, so lovely. Um, and let's talk about the scenario today because that's really important, especially mm -hmm. because of the subject matter and mm -hmm. shooting roles and all of those things. Mm -hmm. And you sent in a fantasy, and I was it like, did. how am I going to do this? <laughs> <laughs> so if you would explain that. So this has been like an ongoing fantasy of mine for like years even. Um, where I would be like coming home from wherever and it's like at nighttime and I'm about to walk into my front door and someone kind of comes from the bushes or somewhere in the darkness of wherever and um, comes up from behind me with a knife and holds the knife at my throat and like threatens me and tells me, you know, not to scream, whatever. And then um, ends up chloroforming me, subduing me, and then all of a sudden you just see him drag my body into the house and uh, shut the door and then, you know, I wake up bound or whatever and he's about to have his way with me so that's always been an ongoing fantasy of mine now yeah it's with one person but i think you know you could do it with the group setting. yeah <laughs> so we have um we have a a way that we're going to work around that i'm not going to tell them tell exactly it. but uh i just wanted to make sure that we got that on camera that this is your fantasy, My fantasy. and something yes. that you are willing and, and wanting to do mm -hmm. awesome absolutely any as always, we play with safe words. Safe words are? Um, when things are getting a little too much, you say it, and then we stop. And what are the safe words that we use in this building? Red. And? I don't know what the other one is. Whoa! It's been a while since I've been here. The Whoa! only one I've ever I was known. Like, for sure she'd know that. Yeah, no, ever, ever since I've uh, worked here, the only one I've ever known was red. So okay. Maybe. So, uh, red, still our safe word here. Please call that at any time today for whatever reason. Doesn't matter. Uh, we'll stop. We'll check in with you. We'll make sure everything is okay. If your mouth is obstructed with something. Oh. Yeah. I know that yeah. one. I thought there was another physical. Okay, verbal. Yeah. <laughs> no. Yes, it's uh-uh. Right. Uh-uh-uh. Yeah. Uh -uh -uh -uh. uh -uh -uh. yep. mm -hmm. Very animated. Same thing. We'll check in with you uh, and make sure you want to continue. And do you know what the slow down word is? Yellow? I don't know. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yellow, yellow, okay. or, yellow or mercy. Okay. Um, which means... Uh, ease it back. Ease it back. Yeah. They're not going to come out of character, but they'll ease, ease it, back it back or move on to something else. Okay. That's it. All right. Are you ready to make all of your gangbang fantasies come I'm, to I'm life? I'm ready. I'm Please excited. Please say goodbye to all of your fans. Okay. Hope you guys enjoy it.